Okay, hello guys, welcome to a new video and today I'm gonna tell you how I edit my pictures. Super exciting. Yeah, where to start? Uh, I don't wanna make this video too long because it's actually pretty simple. So I'm just gonna tell you the basics and if you have any questions, just ask them below and I'll try to answer them. So, uh, first of all, I edit my picture. <laughs> First of all, what camera do I use? That's a really good question. Thank you. Okay, I use the Sony a7 III with a Zeiss 35mm lens uh, 2.8 something. I don't really know what that means, but yeah, that's what I use. I really like that camera. Uh, it's perfect. So if you're looking for a really good camera and you have a little bit of money saved up, buy this one. <laughs> I gotta tell you, I tried a lot of cameras and this is my favorite so far. I shoot in JPEG, not in RAW, which is quite weird for some of you, maybe, but I really don't like RAW. I like JPEG more because it just gives more color to my picture and it doesn't take that much space on your laptop. So that's what I do with my camera. And after that, I edit them for Instagram because that's what I do every single day. Uh, I really like editing pictures, I love it. And that's why I try to expand my horizons and learn as much about it as possible. So because of that, I discovered Lightroom. Probably a little late, but I discovered it. Lightroom is an app that you have on your laptop. You can also have it on your phone. If you want it on your laptop, it costs around 12 euros a month. If you want it on your phone, it's for free. But I have to say, I think on my phone, it's a little harder to use. On my laptop, it's easier to use. So I have it on both, but I actually only use the one on my laptop. So on Lightroom, you have what we call presets. Ta-da! And presets are your biggest friends because they are filters, basically. Uh, they're presettings in Lightroom, uh, which has different, blah, blah, blah. Um, you can have different colors, you can add the colors a certain way. How do you explain a preset? It's so hard. Okay, I'm gonna show you the presets later. I'm right now trying to figure out how I can record my screen. Mm. It's really cool that that's even an option, right? I don't really understand. Ah, I got it. Okay, here we go. Okay, so I think this is working. All right, so let me get to Lightroom. So here I have my Lightroom. I use Lightroom Classic CC. Um, so this is your screen. This is where you open your photos. Uh, you first come here to the library. Oh, I'm sorry, mine is in Dutch. That might not be super convenient. Let me check if I can change that. Probably not. So, mine is in Dutch. We just have to get used to it. All right. So, um, then we go to develop, I think. And here is where you have your preset screen. So, let's start with this picture. I'm a gangster girl, as you can see. Um, on this screen here, you have all the settings. And as you can see right now, they're all quite untouched they're all at zero so and then on this side you have your presets and these are the ones that I made that I will use for this video preset 1 to preset 4 as you can see preset 4 is not a success on this picture but preset 1 on the other hand is way better so what happens is this preset changes the yeah settings right here so for my pictures, I will use, for this one, I will use preset 1. Uh, and actually, it's pretty good. I wouldn't really change anything on this picture. I think it looks really nice. So yeah, what I do then is then I export it and give it a name. I'm now at baby123. Super weird, I know. But then I'll export it and it's saved and then I'll send it to my phone. A different picture, here I have... This one that I also posted a while ago. Uh, here are my presets. As you can see, preset two works better on this one, so I'll add preset two. I do think it's a little too light around here, so I'll try and change that. So the shadows, oh no, that will give my face. Maybe just put the white down a little bit and I'll probably just 
cut off this half because I don't really know how that works. What I want to show you also is uh, what are the stats or the settings that I use on a frequently basis. Basically on almost every picture I change my skin color because uh, that's just different with every lighting. So that's where you go, you go to, you go down and you go to illuminate and you just change that just the way you want it. I always like to give myself a good tan so I always put it a little down. And for example if you don't like the blue you can just make the blue way darker. You can also make it less warm or more warm, whatever you like. And you can also give it, you can also make yourself purple. Isn't that crazy? So yeah, these are my settings that I use. Here's another picture. I would use the preset two on this one as well. I really like that. Here's a picture with Isaiah. Uh, I would also use two or one. And then here we have my face with a hat. And look, preset 4 is a little too dark. Preset 3, 2, 1. I think I'll go for 1 or 2. Uh, one of these 2's. So, just to show you the difference. This is the before and this is the after. So, this is really light. So, I would definitely put the lighting down a little bit. Because it's way too much. This is just the shadows. Um, this is... The whites in a picture and these are the blacks in a picture and then I would give myself a little bit more of a tan and then I would put the white up a little bit and look what's also funny is here you have the reds and this is the color of your lips most of the time so I like it if my lips are a little light because they are pretty light I think so I'll leave it like that. So now the before and after, the before and then the after. So before and after. Yeah, I love it. I like it. Maybe the blacks down a little bit. So yeah, that's basically how I do it. Oh, and look, here I have all the other filters. This is Tessa. Uh, Zula says uh, this is myself and this is Davy Flu I think I tried a lot of her filters look they all look pretty good too so you could also try those ones so isn't that fun I mean let's be honest it's super fun to do I can do this all day I mean this is my favorite part of making pictures for Instagram is editing them okay so that was it that is how I edit my pictures and good news since today my website is live where I sell my presets so the ones that I just used uh, you can buy for $13.50 <laughs> Uh, yeah, I would love to see how you use my presets and how they look on your pictures. So please show me and also if you have any questions, which I can imagine because Lightroom is pretty hard, you can ask them in the comments below and I'll try to answer them. And also on my website I will link some YouTube videos uh, which explain how Lightroom works pretty well. And maybe I'll link them down here below because... I have to say it took me quite a while to really get used to it so I think it is really nice if you have the tools to know how it works. Okay, so enjoy your day, I'll enjoy mine and I hope you'll check out my presets and let me know what you think uh, and then I'll talk to you later. Okay, bye guys. Ooh, quick side note. I'll be doing my vlogs in Dutch from now on again. I'm really sorry, but I really miss my Dutch vlogs. So it's still gonna be with English subtitles, but it is gonna be in Dutch again. And I'm actually really excited about it. And for all you people who don't speak Dutch, see it as a good way to learn Dutch, because it's a beautiful language. Don't play at the